928. Stock market's gonna open two, in two minutes. Volatility yesterday was insane based on that new vaccine announcement. I can make thousands on this trade today, but I need to act right when the market opens. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh no, come on. Come on, I could lose thousands off on this. Hey everyone. Well, I wish it was a long time no see, but uh, here we go again. Stock application is down, our users can't trade, and here we are again trying to solve the problem. The mess. Yeah, hey guys, I'm uh um I've I've got a I've got a couple of different things. I, I'm gonna need a little bit more time. Yeah, maybe like a day or hey, something. Guys, hey, the database looks good for me as always. I don't know what I'm doing here. Hey, Rich, maybe you have some ideas? I'm looking at my Excel uh, tables here, and the data is old. I'm going to have to get another refresh of data. So it's going to take me another couple of hours before I can get that all up to date and back to you. I thought I had emailed you that Excel file. Should I go check again? Maybe I should check that. Boy, this is a mess. Hey, Eric, uh, this is Carlos Peterson from ServiceNow. Um, I heard about uh, the Stock Trader Online going down today. I, can you tell me about some of the challenges you've been experiencing? Yeah, I mean, as you can see, it's, it's a real problem. The application is down now, as it frequently is. Um, I'll give you a lot more detail, but just in a simple kind of the most salient points, we need to improve the availability of this thing. If it does go down, we need to be better able to handle it and recover it as quickly as possible. We just can't go on like this anymore. Eric, first let's get us start by understanding the required capabilities to move your IT operations teams from a reactive to a predictive state. For other AI ops vendors in the marketplace who only ingest alerts for correlation can never be more than reactive since the related issues already happen. Our platform provides observability by ingesting, analyzing, and surfacing up valuable insights on metrics, logs, and alerts. And this is a key capability for improving your overall service availability by surfacing up these anomalies before there's an impact to a service or an application. Now with these anomalies and related alerts, they can be clustered in real time by time, text, and topology. And then the platform will create actionable incidents, auto route the incident to the correct SMEs to quickly get them engaged. Now, finally, the platform enables collaboration with L2, L3, or DevOps teams through mediums such as Slack. The integration hub can now enable existing automation or orchestration investments to either provide triage information or even perform recovery actions to help drive down MTTX. Lastly, we wanna be able to surface up those valuable insights in real time to identify things like probable root cause analysis, all within context to the issue. So with ITOM health and visibility, resolution times will be truncated and you'll see your services such as the Stock Trader Online availability improve. Hey, Eric, uh, what do you think of some of the capabilities we have with the ServiceNow platform that might address some of your challenges? Yeah, I love what you've shown me so far. I'd love to, to dive deeper, maybe see even something. I know you were going to maybe show me some live examples. Love to see it and see what else we can do. Perfect. Let's jump into a demo and replay your Stock Trader Online outage and see how we would have uh, done things a little differently. All right? Great. Fantastic. Thanks. Yeah. Eric, let's replay the Stock Trader online outage with ITOM visibility and health in place. I'll play the role of your database administrator. And as a SME, I typically don't log in traditional event management consoles, but collaborate using mediums such as Slack. And then I look at 
KPIs related to uh, critical platforms and applications in dashboards like Grafana. Let's see how ServiceNow brings observability to the environment that your IT operations teams are used to working in. So I just received a Slack notification identifying a problem with the database after the platform analyzed the data. And essentially this link here will bring me directly to the operator workspace in context to the emerging outage. Now, what I can also uh, view from the platform perspective is the observability data that's surfaced by ServiceNow in the environment that I typically work in. So this is a Grafana dashboard. I have the application models that discovered and also all of the data that's being analyzed by the platform. And even from here, I can do issues with JVMs and a, a database. And then also I can see that we start to see a performance degradation with some of our APIs. And we get that same alert proactively invited to get engaged with indicating that MySQL root of this cause. So either from Slack or from my dashboard that I'm used to working with, I can go directly into the operator workspace. There's a ticket that has been auto-created and assigned to my support group, as well as to me individually. We have four alerts that have been grouped and even the platform has identified probable root. These are some of the insights that are surfaced. We understand now that not only are the tiers that support the purchase and inventory of the stock trader online application, but the stock trader online is impact. In fact, we can click on the root cause. Looks like there's there is a change that's been made on this configuration item last night during the change window. And in fact, it looks like MySQL was upgraded to 5.7 from 5.6. Now, there could be uh, some JVM, uh, JDBC driver incompatibility issues. Either way, now I've got at least some background and potentially valuable information that is um, causing the issue. And looks like it's indicated the uh, root cause is, is related to a change. After we reverted some of the changes that were causing some of the problems that the platform surfaced, now that Stock Trader is in a good health. So, good guys, it's great to see you guys. I'm glad for once we're talking when we're not hearing about that damn stock trading application being down. Um, you guys having a good experience with the new with the new service now tool set to do the uh, proactive ITOM? Yeah, uh, it looks like there's no analysis needed for me. The system is everything. Uh, I hope I still have a job here. Yeah, I really love this automation. The troubleshooting is more, more easy. I love it. Well, I'm really going to miss my Excel files. And hey guys, did everybody get my email about the happy hour to celebrate our go live? Yeah. yeah.